But thanks for joining us today. We're in the uh, we're back in the tannery again, and actually, what we're looking at right now is what we call a wet end drum. And as you can see here, as I walk a bit closer to it, is what you can see is that um, with this drum, this is where we do all the uh, dyeing processes. And uh, you can see that we call this a Y-shaped jump drum because there is a Y-shaped transition within the drum here that you can see. And you can see the little paddles there on the left-hand side and the right-hand side. And those paddles lift the hides up and crash them back down again, causing what we call uh, mechanical action. And that mechanical action is what drives the, uh, the chemicals into the leather product, which gives it its softening, its color, and various other things. So, so that's what we, we do here. I'm gonna take you now uh, upstairs so you can see down into the drum. Um, so if we, if we run up the steps here, um, and you'll be able to see here as well that we have the mixing vat. So all of the chemicals uh, go into here. And here we have various different chemicals that we, that we use throughout the tanning and the dyeing process. Um, and the drum that we were looking at is over here. And you can see again the mixing drum, so we pre-mix all of the materials in these drums. Um, and then if we look then here is the nice funky uh, control panel and then if you look inside the drum here as well I'm gonna lose me now for a sec you see the Y shape and you can see the paddles and it's compartmentalized so what the compartmentalization does is it stops all the hides tangling themselves up knotting themselves together and it prevents what we call a phenomenon called hot spotting, where sometimes you get localization uh, reaction. So, gotta watch out because here's a batch of hides coming up now behind me. As you can see, there's our man Janny down there loading up pretty well. Say hi, Janny. Okay, that's it. That's how we die. Thanks.